Hey, what's going on, you guys? This is Unfading Silence. First off, just want to give a huge shout out to anyone that is part of my YouTube membership program. As always, you guys, thank you so much for your amazing support. I appreciate everything you guys do. Also, anyone that is checking out the video, if you want to support the channel, all you have to do is hit that like button, subscribe, comment. Really helps out the YouTube algorithm. Helps my videos get out there a lot more and everything like that. Helps to broaden the horizon when it comes down to uh, new views and things like that. So with that being said, I do want to be able to put out some Elden Ring content. Um, I'm not putting ESO on the back burner at all. I'm still playing ESO on a regular basis and everything. I haven't been able to stream lately just because of work. Um, we're down a few people and everything at work, so just trying to cover shifts and things like that. But still, back to Elden Ring real quick. Um, I do want to be able to put out some content. I want to be able to put out some builds, whether that be PvE builds or PvP builds. But I'm not going to be releasing any builds anytime soon or anything. Currently, I am working on a faith-based uh, setup and everything. I'm going to go a little mixture with like PvE and PvP. But I don't want to release a build that is not up to par. Like, I want you to be able to actually... Get the, get the sets, get the gear together and everything like that. Get the spells together and so forth. So you can actually go in there and enjoy playing in PvE land or whether that just be playing in uh, PvP. Um, with that being said, this is just a little uh, cheese video. Honestly, I uh, heard about the cheese when it comes down to this boss. I tried to fight him straight up and uh, failed drastically. And uh, then uh, someone let me know, hey, this is how you cheese that boss. And I was like, oh, really? Uh, I'm all about that uh, dairy, you know? So let's just uh, enjoy the cheese. And uh, this boss, honestly, it gives you one of the best weapons in the game with uh, the Blasphemous Blade. Um, does uh, fire damage. Also heals you when you kill enemies with it. So you can uh, go room farming to your heart's desire and uh, be able to uh, just get a lot of uh, a lot of health back when it comes down to uh, this sword that you end up getting from this uh, this uh, extremely difficult boss if if you didn't cheese it. But uh, if you want to cheese it, that's how you do it. It's real simple, real easy. Doesn't take much. So enjoy the video, you guys, and uh, hopefully soon we will be able to put out some Elden Ring uh, build videos shortly. As I said before, I am working on a pure faith base uh, setup, so that should be dropping pretty soon. So with that being said, you guys, have a good day, have a good night, have a good weekend, whenever it is you end up checking out this video. Take care, and I will catch you on the next one. Peace.